every Friday when we go to a new movie glow. Love it, hate it. My hubby Henry, don't be so constipated, just relax and let Kolaba open Stup review this lovely movie. With Gladys, Miss Picnic, and Mr. Schmeckle too, all the fun we'll get into just for you. So please join us now for the Meshuggah for Movie Show. Meshuggah just means crazy and won't you please subscribe. I'm a complex, unique individual. I think differently and I smell beautifully. I love games and puzzles and I solve the missing can opener caper. Apparently, Mr. Pipnik did not have it in the parlor room. With the can of tuna fish, Henry had it in the bedroom. With the spicy can of beans and I figured it out when I followed the drippy, disgusting mess into the laundry room where he ruined my pink negligee. Now, if I had lived in 1939 London, I would have decoded the German ciphering machine Enigma, but Alan Turing beat me to it. In the imitation game, socially weird Alan Turing, the creator of the first computer, breaks the code and did not even speak a word of German. Yeah. Alan's personality was as difficult to decipher as the, the Enigma, but he took Churchill's words to heart to never, never, never give up. Alan literally defeated Nazism with a crossword puzzle. A normal person couldn't do this. That's why I know I'm abnormal. So I give the imitation game 10 out of 10 Meshuggahs. Henry, you are a big stinker. My idiot is entertaining guests by creating his own game called Name That Food. Basically, Henry farts and the idiot males have to guess what he ate earlier today. Women would never play this game. Women never fart. We play another game watching the hot male gynecologist move into the neighborhood with the binoculars. Oi, I love